I came to Nagpur and told uh, the description of my darshan to my missus and all members of my family. I told them that if you at all you see uh, think of taking his darshan, you tell me any time so that I will take you to Ahmad Nagar and accordingly after uh, say in the month of May they told me that now they want to see the darshan of Avatar Mahabha. Accordingly we went to Pune. From station, I straight uh, went to Guru Prasad, Pune. Baba, then you see, as soon as I stayed in Guru Prasad, people came to me, me and told me that Baba is this seclusion, and how you came without uh, any previous engagement or interview. I went to Pune. Uh, when I went to Kamala, when I went to Pune in Guru Prasad, Baba had already come, and then uh, he sent a message that I am going to give darshan to Mr. Sauji and his family. When I heard this, I was um, much pleased, and I was waiting that moment. So after few minutes, we were taken before Baba. Then uh, I first met Baba. Baba told me that you should not touch my feet and be away. But this time, I was told that Baba is giving me a dress, and all my family members will get it. Then uh, we went there. I, Baba embraced me, my missus, my uh, daughters, three daughters, Alka, Vina, Aruna, and uh, one my relative brother's daughter, uh, Silu, was also with me, and missus Gedam who was sometime a uh, state minister here in Maharashtra state. Baba Andres, all of them. Uh, when my daughter Aruna embraced um, Baba, Baba told her that you take with me uh, when you go to your home. So, the later on we came after his darshan out. Then Baba's uh, secretary and other members, we, I was talking with them and trying to get some information. We were sitting there a few moments. Baba then sent a message that uh, tell all of them that they should take their meals here and then go. So, there I learned that someone was to send some prasad to Baba and that prasad had just came and Baba asked Mandali to serve that prasad to us and we took our meals there. Eating that prasad, everyone was pleased. All uh, members, Eras Bhai, Nana Khet, uh, Dr. Gaur, all were you see then telling many stories about Baba when we were taking our meals. After meals, when we were you see about to go back, 
Baba sent uh, Dr. Goa and conveyed it to me that go and declare to the world that breaking of my silence will be the greatest miracle I will uh, ever, I have ever performed. With this uh, message and the blessings of Baba, I told my, my family members that Baba at Amman Nagar when first met me did not give me embrace because you people uh, were not present but now we had embraced every one of us and this is a very fortunate uh, um, occasion for us in our life. After that um, Baba told uh, someone there and gave his car and told him that let these people uh, go in Pune and take them to station after some time by this car. It was a great pleasure that uh, we were in the car where God was, um, the car which God was using. So I consider myself, all family members, in the car used by God my brother. It is very fortunate that I had an occasion to travel with my all family members in the car used by God my brother. When uh, I wrote to Baba one letter and asked me that you are you blessed me so much when I have not done anything for you. In reply to that letter, Baba wrote to me that uh, you know only of this life, but you have gone several times from me and come to me. So I know what you have done in the past lives. And uh, this is all he told me. I know what you have done in the past life. But uh, Baba told me that uh, you are spreading my messages and you are Devduk. Uh, you are doing good work. My blessings are with you. Um, he many times you see gave me uh, his appreciation of my articles published in my paper. And I used to get letter from him. In one telegram, Baba wrote to me, Tumare Hriday Panchi ke Madhu Gaan Sunkar Mujhe Anand Hota Hai और मैं उस पंची को सदैव अपने पास रखता हूँ तुम्हें और परिवार को मेरा प्रेमा शरावत इन अनदर टेलीग्राम ही रुक नाउ आई एम रीडिंग द ट्रांसलेशन ऑफ हिंदी टेलीग्राम व्हिच जस्ट आई रीड माय बाय लर्निंग द स्वीट सॉन्ग ऑफ द बर्ड ऑफ योर हार्ट आई एम वेरी हैप्पी I keep that bird always with myself. My love, blessings to you and your family, Meher Baba. In another telegram, Baba wrote, Your love and work always make me happy. I am very pleased with you. From my seclusion, my love and blessings to your family, Meher Baba. In in one telegram in, uh, on 25th February 68, Baba wrote, On this my apparent physical birthday, I send my homage and obedience to my lovers who do for me and would if order to my lovers who live for me 
and would be forder die for me in pawn my lovers in nagpur and to chawata meher baba my name is ashalata sauji my name is ashalata sauji i saw baba for the first time at pune at that time my reaction was not good when baba gave darshan to us i saw him just like sitting in front of me and embarrass me please one minute at that time i don't believe such god so i don't want to embarrass him but in our religion we ladies can't permitted to embarrass any other person so my husband said me to embarrass so i embarrassed baba and came back and slowly gradually by hearing the baba stories and contacts that those peoples i ready to agreed him and we went at amadnagar my husband got accident there and when we came back at nagpur he fevered for for month and at that time i was lying in night at 10 o'clock and baba came near me and and bless me and touch me and and i know from that touch that baba said me don't worry i am with you and at that moment i came to know him and i love him very much in another another dream one day thief came to our house and take him all stainless steel utensils and all, all other things and went away and in mor- in the morning when i got i saw that there is, there is nothing in our house so i told my husband that there is nothing in our house something someone may take this all he told us don't worry and when we were uh, sitting and uh, at that time a man came in and he asked for my husband he came in our in this room so in a um, seat in a chair and saw baba's photo he kept quiet and then asked he went away or came with 